player up and running. I think we just need to find whatever file search is in here. File manager, that'd be the one. Let's go to APKs. Go ahead and open that, sure. I would love to install 10.1. Hopefully update to 10.2, which just came out yesterday or today, I believe. Uh, okay, we're done. Sounds good. Now they asked me to open the market app, which is get back to the home screen here which I can't see there we go and let's go find the market app there it is yeah this I'm gonna have to take a little second here to hide this okay we're gonna go ahead and open the market app and uh, once it loads just press the home button and then we're going to go and manage applications through the settings but first we'll let this thing load up it could take a few minutes because I just entered my Google account information for the first time I just got a new mail notification that's a good sign that I've been connected to my services hopefully the market will load up here quick so I can finish getting this flash on here and uh, last but not least make sure the market works and um, right now it's really just not happening but I'm supposed to wait till it loads and I'm getting impatient so See what happens. Since I have a feeling it's just going to keep doing this, we're going to go ahead and just try it anyways and hope that this is loaded enough to clear the data. So let's go ahead and uh, let's go home and go to settings, manage applications, okay, and um, market should be on here. Here's market. Click on it, and we're going to first clear data. Okay. Which should be clear, and then for stop, back to your home screen and open up the market. So let's go do that. And we actually want to get an error. This is good. Supposedly, it's good. <laughs> Now reboot the device is pretty much the next thing we have to do. We got the error we wanted, so let's go ahead and reboot, which is holding down power will give us the option. Uh, of course I got to force close. Now we'll reboot. Let everything normalize again and um, open it again and I think it should be good. We have to open it and reboot one more time. So unfortunately we are caught in a boot loop, but I'd like to show you what it is because here you go, you get the ViewSonic screen and then you'll get GTAB devs and then back to ViewSonic and it's just going to do this. So uh, I'm going to show you how to fix that right now because I have to fix it. Okay, so if you get the boot loop, you pretty much got to hold down power and the volume up button to interrupt it, which I didn't realize for a second there. I was kind of tripping, but we're good. Let's go to, a, um, we're going to partition the SD card. So we need to go to uh, at the bottom. I think it's under advanced actually. And here we have partition the SD card. Shouldn't be too big a deal. And it says the first one you want to choose is 2048. Go ahead and pick that. And the second one is going to be 0. And do 7 through 10 again. Great. Okay, we're done. Unfortunately, we have to redo the steps that mounting and flashing the ROM. Alright, just want to show you that uh, after formatting I was able to get the market working. Of course, hey, I just was downloading, there we go. And as you can see it's, it's all there. And let's go to my, uh, where do we find the downloads? Maybe. It's very cool like how smooth everything yeah. is. Your item will be downloaded. That's what I like to see. It's very snappy. Unbelievable. Now, if Flash is working... Go the hmm. Oops.
Looking pretty good.